all and welcome along to our Champions League studio, everybody. I'm Kate Abdo, joined by Arsenal's all-time leading goal scorer Thierry Henry, Champions League winner with Liverpool, Jamie Carragher, and the man who yawned his way through my entire introduction, <laughs> Micah <laughs> Richard. What were you doing in 2007, no, Kate? I didn't know that this is where the joke was going. Nicky! Uh, yeah. Roll oh, 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 And oh, welcome oh, to Top oh, Magazine. Oh, Weekly fix of science and culture on DWTV. In the other big football game in Europe today, Chelsea and Manchester United met in the newly opened Wembley Stadium for the FA Cup final. Once you get to the supermarket, it's you that pushes around the trolley. So presumably, you decide what goes in it. Oh my god. Okay, hold on, hold on, hold on. Can we get the first clip again? I want it again. I want to listen to the action. Run it again, please. We have to listen. Run it again, please. Can we roll it Hello and welcome to Top Magazine. Magazine. Yeah. Welcome to Top Magazine. <laughs> <laughs> what was you wearing? Oh, no. Wow! When did you stop being English? <laughs> the news or the rumour is that the person that they have top of their list is Xavi Alonso, who obviously we've talked about potentially going to your Liverpool. Is that bad news for Liverpool? Yes, if there's uh, <laughs> other people in, in for him, of course, in for his signature. Uh, why don't you just text him? Well, you say you've got this great influence amongst teammates. Well, I, I just think he's, he's he's got his focus on Leverkusen at the moment. He's still seeing me stories on Instagram, so I can still see. Oh, he's he's, he's, he's keeping it. He's, he's checking in on I, me. Has he replied to you? No, no. But I think we just <laughs> we'll get to the March international break and I'll see what's going on. It's been a weird relationship, hasn't it, between player and club? Is that fair to say? Yeah, it, it, it feels like it, it. Napoli is a club that he's not going to for the rest of his career he feels like he can go on to bigger and better things but he signs a contract and straight away he's talking about where he's going to go in the summer I think there's a bio clause there for 100 million and it feels like some sort of deal's being done between all parties that I'll sign a new contract my wages will go through the roof rightly so for what he did last season but there's a deal there if someone wants to do one in the summer yeah, let's not forget though, I mean, it's not been great this season, but last season he was fantastic. Serie A player of the year, we was banging him out about him all last season, what he could do, his link-up play, the goals he scored. So yeah, he, he might just think it's the right time for him to, to move on, a different challenge. But we are talking about a club that hasn't got a clear idea where to go next. Names that have been mentioned, discussed, analysed and they've had reports on. Tuchel, surprisingly enough, Hansi Flick, Roberto De Zerbi, and then there is another list, the impossible list, Xavi Alonso, Klopp, forget those, that's not going to happen, Mikel Arteta either. So, they are looking for something that's modern, different, football played at a different pace, perhaps with more success in Europe, the Hansi Flick, the Tuchel way, or a better version of what they're doing, the Roberto De Zerbi way. But nothing has been decided yet, and meanwhile, they're sticking with Xavi for how long, we don't know. Probably until the end of the season. But let's see what happens in this fixture against Napoli. I would say, well done, big man, because winning the league, and I know how it is there, in Again, what he had to deal... We've got to remember, it wasn't a poor Real Madrid, was it? I mean, Real Madrid is the European that's champions. What, that's what I'm saying. He, he, exactly, and he won the league into that trouble. Yes. At times at Barcelona, it's very difficult to maintain and st sustain that because, because of what you, we've seen and we heard. But for a legend of the club, now the second one that leaves the club, Pep and Xavi, because of maybe the pressure and you feel like a sabbatical year when you have a team like that and you coach Messi and you're in your, in your boyhood club, I'm talking, talking about Pep, and now Xavi, that has been a coolie since coolie, uh, uh, yes. a Barca fan, no, I'm just a Barca fan. So, You've been there, you won there, you won as a coach. And for you to just go like, hey, hey it's too much. It's too much. It, it, it is not easy. Like, again, understand me well, and I, uh, <laughs> I love, <laughs> no, because I love when I say that, that's why. <laughs> I, I enjoyed my time at Barcelona. I cannot say I didn't enjoy it. But when things are not going well in Barcelona, you need to be really, really strong to be able to hold on to the pressure, I'm telling you. But do Arsenal still need to bring a number nine, a striker in in the summer? OK, so in the summer, yeah, I can understand a bit better when, when people were screaming about a striker in January because who are you bringing in January that are better than the, the players that you have? They just need to put the ball in the back of the net. But to go back to your point, yes, I think that's something that Mikel Arteta is going to look uh, upon at the end of the season and see who he can bring in his team. Osserman? Sorry? Osserman? Uh, you need to call Mikel for that. <gasps> okay. But 
I have breaking news. In the title race, <laughs> Liverpool zero, Luton uno. <laughs> You alright, Della? Feel sick. <laughs> <laughs> oh, God, your reaction. Is it? Is it? <laughs> Never really want to keep your feelings under wraps when you're watching a football game. I thought are I was you? quite calm then. <clears throat> Did you? Let, let's relive your Did journey you? with Roll you. Red. Listening to this. <laughs> Liverpool zero, Luton uno! <laughs> yeah. Mm. Oh, come on, Jay. It's the numbers on Sky. Oh. Oh. It's when you told That's me to move. <laughs> I had it that in like one day. Come on! Oh my god! <laughs> <laughs> I'm doing the Basil Fawlty walk! Oh my god, it's 2-2! Two, two. Is it? No, I'm joking. Oh. <laughs> oh my god. Don't worry, the mighty Reds won. <laughs> <laughs> when you get a statue, what, what I mean, what, what do you get? Have you got like the freedom of the stadium? Can you go in anywhere you want? Bring anyone you with? I mean, there must be some perks that yeah. come with a statue. I think that's enough, right? That's, that's, the statue that, itself. Yeah. Did you like how you look? Do you remember the Ronaldo statue and that whole fiasco? Do you like how you look in your statue? Uh, yes, 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 yeah. And we... Oh, there he is! Hey, look at that! Iconic! I didn't miss the big forehead. Game, I am loving the autumn collection. You look fantastic. <laughs> Thank you. you, you it, it is autumn <laughs> still, isn't it? It feels like that anyway, <laughs> Napoli. It looks like Kate's shirt last night, I think. Well, because it's flowery and colourful, isn't that what we're supposed to do? Show that we love life in our, the way we wear things? Spot yes. on, Guillaume. Spot yes. on, Guillaume. Yes. We can't all wear grey every week, can we, Guillaume? Javi! Como estas? Hey, Titi, Jamie. Javi, <laughs> the legend. Oh. <laughs> uh, um, you missed Micah there, so sort of, uh... Do you know who Micah Richards is? <laughs> Yeah, yeah, my guy. Yeah. Yes, of course, he knows me. First and foremost, I want to start with, I've been impressed with the job that you've done there. I don't care what people say, you won the league. Be proud, and I know you are, and I'm very proud that I, I shared the field with you, and you taught me a lot going to Barcelona, and you told me to shut up before I can talk <laughs> to, because I never won anything at Barcelona. You said to me one day, I always remember, you said, talk when you win at Barcelona and then you will understand what this club means. So thank you for 